Hey, welcome to Guitar Solo Reactions. Today, this is Muse, and this is a new song called Kill or Be Killed. Uh, I'm somewhat familiar with Muse. Um, what was the big record, The Black Holes and Revelations? Um, I liked that record when it came out. I'm trying to think of what year that was. That would probably be, um, well, 2006. It's, it's newer than I thought. Um, but I remember hearing that Knights of Caledona or whatever that is and being kind of blown away. And it was rare that I heard things on the rec on the radio. This is on the radio that I was like, caught me by surprise. And, um, you know, I, I never bought the record, but I've checked out some of the songs, um, you know, in different formats or maybe, uh, someone loaned me the record, whatever. So um, I didn't know they were such a huge band, um, and I, I didn't for a long time, and then I kind of, um, a couple years ago, listened to that record again and thought that was cool, and um, I think, actually, previous to that, they had played in Seattle, and it was sold out at a pretty big arena, and I was like, whoa, I mean, I, you know, they're totally cool, but I didn't know they were immensely popular to boot. So, um the band um is uh it, who's the i'm trying to i'm going to look up their names cuz i i the guitar player i've read in interviews has all sorts of cool stuff on his guitar like a chaos pad and um all sorts of stuff like that i haven't looked at what he has been using recently but matt bellamy is the person i was trying to remember his name and uh christ uh wolstenholm is the bass guitar player and vocalist and Dominic Howard is drums. And it's amazing three guys can play such kind of complicated, expansive, uh, and interesting music. So uh, this is a brand new song. I haven't heard anything from them since that record, the Black Holes and Revelations record um, that I can think of. So kind of a complete uh, first reaction first uh, hearing, first seeing, all that kind of stuff. Um, hey, thanks. If you're joining me for the first time, please like, subscribe, and comment, and uh, come back for more. If you have a favorite Muse song, put it in the comments. Uh, I'd love to hear what uh, fans really like. I'm not a fan, uh, per se. Uh, I like what they do, and uh, maybe after this song, I will be uh, kind of catching up on more of what they've been doing. But... I'd love for you to tell me. So that. Uh, here we go. Uh, Muse with the new song, Kill or Be Killed. This sounds more like Gojira to me right off the bat. That's kind of cool. Beautifully recorded, massive guitars, great dynamics, cool and
I like it's heavy in different ways than like heavy stuff I listen to. It's it's got a lot of cool ups and downs and all the riffs are got a little bit of a twist that they're got a little major ish sounding to them. They're not as dissonant. And, you know, they have the great soaring vocals, as always, uh, from what I remember. Cool guitar. Oh, man, that's massive. What a great voice. Oh, there is a keyboard player back there. uses a lot of the whammy pedal stuff kind of like the guy in Gojira and many others but that's kind of what reminded me of There you have it. Muse doing the song Killer Be Killed off their new record called Will of the People. All pretty new to me. Uh, killer tune. Kind of got some really heavy, uh, kind of lots of shifts in the stuff. Like as far as like kind of the death metal vocals a little bit there for a second. Some pretty heavy riffs with a, still a lot of cleaned up, some process, process stuff. Anyway. I don't know what the hell I'm saying, but kick-ass song. I can't wait to hear more. Hey, uh, while I have you here, if you have some favorite Muse tunes, send them my way. I'd love to check out more. I'd love to hear what fans like, not what I kind of uh, naturally come across. And uh, I didn't know they had a new record out till today, and I thought, I'm going to do it. And I had no indication or no thought that it would be as heavy as this. So, super, super pleasing great record or great song at least i look forward to hearing more uh thanks for joining me i'm brian